So under the rubric of module one is um, some basic file metadata. Um, so this book is called Peter Pan, written by J.M. Barry, and it's open source. It doesn't have a copyright statement. Most books will have a copyright statement. And the best place to store them in InDesign is up under File and File Info. So, uh, and of course it's on the wrong screen. This is a good place to store some really basic metadata, and I'll show you later how this gets preserved in the ebook. So um, I don't, there's a lot of options here, most of which I pay no attention to because it's not going to have any impact on the ebook. But some basic fields will. So a document title, an author, um, you can you can tell if it's copyrighted or not. In this case, it's public domain, and I'm putting a copyright notice with my name on it. Obviously, that's facetious, but this is where you would put your own copyright statement, like copyright 2023, you know, um, invisible books or whatever, whatever the publishing house is, or maybe the author name, whatever the copyright statement is from your copyright page, can go right here, and all of this info will get preserved in the ebook. It's also a good best practice to store this information here for archival reasons um, because that will stay with this file and when you re-export the ebook that basic metadata will stay, will get preserved.